Hi there, my name is Aaron Lanchman. I'm a professor of electrical and computer engineering at Georgia Tech, and this is the Atari 7800 version of a Galaga. But it's not the original. If you look closely, you'll see that the sprite for the main player ship and the sprites for the missiles that are shot by the player ship, those are different than the original because this is a modified version of Galaga that Nico Bartolome, one of my retrofuturistic hardware vertically integrated project students, formulated. And this is not a ROM hack. This was recompiled from source code that was recovered from floppy disks that were found in a dumpster. So I would like to show you how to compile this code yourself. So you want to go to Nico's GitHub page and get the Atari 7800-conversion project. There's a whole bunch of stuff here. In particular, a bunch of these directories are going to have a special conversion script that's written in Python that my students William Braga and Sam Jane created. It's conversion script.py. The point of that script is to take whatever the syntax of the assembler that people creating the original games used and convert that to a more modern assembler syntax, namely DASM. However, this is only a partial conversion process. There's still a lot of manual cleanup work that usually needs to be done. In one of my earlier videos, I show how to run the script on some DigDug source code, and I modify that a bit and have a bit of fun. Okay, so let's go to the main page here, click on code. Let's copy the address for the GitHub. I'm gonna make a working directory called w just out of habit. So let's do git clone that address, clone the repository. All right, so let's see what we have here. Inside this Atari conversion folder, if you want to run the enhanced version of Galaga, go to the galaga.enhanced folder, galaga underscore enhanced, and the underscore dasm is a suffix we put on directories to indicate that we actually managed to fully do the conversion. Other directories that don't have an underscore DASM aren't working yet. All right, so if we look in here, the thing that we want is gload. So let's type code glo.asm, and this basically does all of the main inclusions and things. So there's a header that we have to add, and then there's a bunch of includes. All right, so I'm going to assume here that you have Atari Dev Studio installed, and that you have it set up to point to the 7800 emulator and not the 2600 emulator. I have another video where I talk about how to do that. Let's see. With the way I have my VS Code set up, I also need to change this to DASM. So DASM is the language. And now I can hit compile source code and run an emulator. And there you go. So if you want to try out the original unmodified Galaga, let's go to the standard version, go to the converted folder, and let's type code glo.asm there, load that up in Visual Studio Code, and now let's run that. Whoops, I have to change this to DASM. Now we can run that. And now you can see Galaga with the original sprites.